The first requirement you need is 20 seconds of health seat hold. The second requirement is upside down deadlifts. You should be able to do at least five reps clean. The third requirement is 10 to 15 clean pull-ups. And the fourth requirement is 10 to 15 tuck front lever hold. The first progression is tuck dragon flag. You should be able to hold that for 10 to 15 seconds before moving to the next progression. The second progression is advanced tag dragon flag. The third progression is one leg dragon flag. If you are in this progression, you should be doing both legs. The fourth progression is advanced one leg dragon flag. You basically come to one leg dragon flag and you extend your knee a little bit forward. Like that. The fifth progression is half leg dragon flag. The sixth progression is straddle dragon flag. Vamos. Oh. Whoa. And the last progression is the full dragon flag. Oh. Now to the exercises. Take a progression you can hold for 10 to 15 seconds. For example, tag dragon flag. The second exercise is negative dragon flags. Take the progression you can control the most and do it for three to five reps. The third exercise is dragon flag raises. Let's say you can do raises with the one leg. The fourth exercise is dragon flag extensions. Also pick the progression you can do you can control the most. The fifth exercise is switching legs dragon flag. Now for the sixth progression, it's called the impossible plank, but it's not impossible. It looks like this. You want to squeeze your glutes in and suck your belly in so you can maintain a slightly hollow back. If you want to achieve the dragon flag, you should train at least two to three times a week. Make sure to rest properly before each workout because those skills are stressing a lot of your joints. Rest between two to five minutes between each set and choose the right progression that feels best for you and you can hold and do it for reps and don't rush to change the progression to upgrade the progression master the first one then move on to the second one so on and so forth 
you need to be patient in order to achieve any skill and any heart exercise in general. If you like this video, please like, subscribe, share and comment. See you guys on the next one. Peace.